respect you. Okay, let me transfer to the nurse, okay? That's your tone, son. Yo le voy a la maestra. Come for the pit rally today. Your books? Yes. What does it say there? Which one are you gonna test? How may I help you? Self-awareness to me is, is being uh, self-aware of your emotional expressions, of your vocal tone, you know, are you rolling your eyes when people talk to you, uh, you know, are you smiling, you, you know, when you should be smiling, it's just being aware of, of your facial expressions and your, and your, you know, emotional intelligence. To me, self-regulation means the ability to pause for a second, take a moment, see what's happening in that moment and control your emotions, control yourself to be able to handle what's happening around you. If they see that I can control myself and stay calm and not get mad and not yell and, and I stop and I listen, then they tend to want to talk to me, want to express themselves to me. We want to get the best of the students. Uh, we motivate the, the players, the students in the classroom as well to get the best of them. Uh, we want to make them feel comfortable. Uh, we want to make them believe that uh, you know, what they're trying to accomplish is, is, is important. And, uh, and that's how we you know, get them to, to motivate. A parent said she didn't have a car, but that she would be here uh, in about 20 to 30 minutes as she was walking let her know that her son was stable and that we would call for an ambulance if, and um, she said well I'll be there in a little bit please don't call until I arrive and typically if the case is in the, you know depending on the case you know we can't wait sometimes um, but um, after assessing and triaging the situation uh, we were able to say that yes we're gonna I'm gonna wait for a little bit and so we waited and when she got a few minutes away she called so that we could call the ambulance and coordinate that they would both arrive at the same time. Otherwise, she wouldn't have transportation to get to the hospital to be with her child. That's my nature. I mean, I was raised like that. I mean, regardless, you know, if they say good morning to me, and uh, I guess, you know, that's the first face they see. I start picking up uh, students at 6.25 uh, in the morning. So all the way until about 8.15, you know, when I drop everybody in their respective schools, uh, th it does work. It does work. I mean, they, I mean, my students are always, you know, if they don't say anything to me, at least they give me a smile. 